This week, Mikhail takes on the men of the British royal family. But first, a tip on how to make a really good martini. The secret for a martini is it must be cold. So it's always easier if you already freeze your spirits before to use it. That's my personal freezer. So just stick your booze in a frozen leg and that works. And in case you haven't got a frozen leg, just use your freezer in your kitchen. Prince William one day will become the king of England. And for what I've heard about him, he doesn't really drink beer, he drinks cider. So obviously I'm pretty sure that he likes apple. So because we are on a martini, the king of the cocktails, I think we're going to play around with a very simple apple martini. It's cool, it's a not too strong gin, so it's going to let the flavor of apple express itself. If you don't know how too much you can do, use just a simple shot glass. Three parts of gin for one part of apple juice. Fresh cinnamon sticks. Just take it into your drink. It's going to help, it's going to infuse with some delicious flavor. No drink. It's like a woman, when she's got some makeup, sometimes it looks better. So, just cut your apple like this, and just carry on. Straight on top. Should stay here. There we go. That's what I will say from Chris Williams. Enjoy. Okay, so now we're gonna speak about Prince Charles. I've read somewhere that Camilla has said that Prince Charles' favorite dessert it's a diabetic organic tiramisu. So I'm pretty sure it's a love of chocolate martini. So let's see how you can make a chocolate martini at home. Let's get some vodka. Let's make it two parts of vodka for two parts of chocolate liquor. For your martini. Very simple. There we go. That's the Prince Charles chocolate martini. Okay, now we're going to make a drink for Prince Harry. Prince Harry has got already a good reputation in London, so if I have to make him a drink, I think I will go for a dirty Harry martini, to be honest with you. If you want to spice things up, a little bit of chili. Ah, should be enough, it's gonna wake him up. And a couple of olive for drink, just to feed them. There we go, enjoy! Mm -hmm. 